the monastery of Shaolin, located in South China, had at one time achieved a great reputation as the cradle of the nation's top kung fu experts. It was also noted as being the area's center of resistance to the Qing government of the Manchus. It was the Manchus who destroyed the monastery, killing most of the inhabitants and forcing the survivors to scatter throughout Guangdong. It was in this way that the influence of the Shaolin Kung Fu style became even more widespread than hitherto. The most famous of the Shaolin disciples who escaped the bloodshed were Hong Si Quan, Feng Si Yu, and Hu Si Qin. However, Feng and Hu died while relatively young. Only Hong Si Quan lived to enjoy old age. It was Hong's Kung Fu, or Hong's style, therefore, that became the most popular style of Kung Fu in Kwantung. The basis of Hung's style rested on the eye-shaped tiger killing technique. This is the first form of the eye-shaped tiger killing technique. This is the dragon and tiger prostrating technique. The demonstrator is Chen Quan Tai. Chen plays the role of Hong Si Quan in the film Heroes 2. This basic technique is called eye shape because the stance of the feet take the form of a Chinese character resembling the shape of the Roman capital letter I. Chinese nationalism is also reflected in Hung's style. For example, this style is called to conquer the center with a single finger. At the time that this style was evolved, the Manchus were occupying central China. Tiger and the stalk techniques are also part of this style. According to legend, it was these techniques that enabled the followers of Hung Si Quan and Hu Hoi Chin to avenge their fathers by killing the character known as the White Brow Priest. The demonstrator here is Fu Sheng, who plays the role of Feng Si Yu in Heroes 2. The Tiger Technique. The tiger claw technique. The stalk technique. The stalk beak technique.
Chinese Kung Fu techniques have always been derived from animal behavior or from natural elements. The snake technique. In Hung style, there are 10 such techniques deriving their inspiration in this way. The demonstrator here is Qi Quan Chun. The tiger technique. The leopard technique. The dragon technique. The stock technique. The metal and wood technique. The fire and water technique. The earth and soil technique. 